for most of the year, or I'd say at least during all the winter months, we run have to run a generator to get electricity. But the generator, typically just to run the house, runs the battery charger, and the how the power for the house comes off the inverter, which you can hear running right now. It's, uh, probably one or two of the refrigerators is running. Um, but we also run a bunch of lights in the house for uh, plants to keep all the house plants alive for the winter because we don't have we lose the sun completely over the uh, hill behind us for a couple months so just to keep everything alive for the next year have to run generator about 12 hours a day uh, the little Honda was the big one that we used for a couple years and it's got over I think we figured 10 to 12 thousand hours on it now uh, a while ago I installed an extended run system on it with a marine tank, six gallon tank, which uh, only fill with a small little two and a half gallon gas can here. Once a day, typically in the winter time, if we're running this one. Uh, most of the time now we run the, the big generator in the winter just to have a, some extra leeway as far as load goes uh, and a, to keep the heavy loads off the small generator. Um, they once they get the running those pretty much similar loads they're about run about the same efficiency uh, exhaust is plumbed outside with just flex pipe here nothing fancy so I have the end taken off of this guy over here uh, but these are some of the greatest generators if I were to need one generator and not have to worry about super heavy loads the Honda 2000 definitely would be would be it. The only thing that's ever been done to it is uh, I had to fix the recoil, the pull cord there, which broke. Uh, I had a few issues with it a couple years ago, but I think it was problems with the, when this is the original cap here, which I modified for, with this bulkhead fitting, but had problems with it uh, not letting air through, so it was like it felt like it was running out of gas. Uh, Great, great, great generators. Really expensive for us in Fairbanks, but you know they're it's well worth it. Uh, the only thing that this thing can't run is a compressor. I don't think it quite has the punch for it. I got to run the big 4600 watt Yamaha generator we have out in the shop to be able to run that. But it'll run anything else. It'll run uh, my welder down here, uh, any power tools, and with the Eco Throttle, it really just it, throttles down saves tons of fuel uh, that's great love them very 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 much